Okay. I was wondering how Twitch Turbo was going to work for streamers. So yeah, no, it's really great. You guys skip the ads, and if you have it on your account, I get paid more than if I had just given an ad to a random person. So incentivizes, if you really want to support a streamer, multiple streamers, and if they're running ads, the best way is instead of instead of subbing to them, it's getting Twitch Turbo, and then they'll if they run ads consistently, they'll get more money out of that, and that helps Twitch stay alive more, and actually make a platform that you know brings in profit instead of you know going to be cannibalized and gutted by Twitch or by Amazon who owns it, and it actually you know does a lot of other stuff for you too. So it's not bad. I, I highly recommend it. For those that can afford it. Especially, didn't they increase the cost of subs, too? So I heard that a lot of people were dropping, you know, subs to other channels. I think the ones that were able to keep mine up, so... Anyways, you out of here? You need to sleep? Have a good night? Stay safe and fly right, man. We'll check you later, LeVan. But yeah, for those that are interested in, join interested in joining the VR Citizens, there's a link to the org. Thank you, Hudson. Let it catch up. We're almost there. It'll be a great day when we get within 100 kilometers. Hey, Johnny, if you can get that other SRV, it doesn't matter. None of this matters. You won't be able to find me. You don't have my party marker. Hello there. Doesn't even fucking matter. Why do I try? Why do I try to play this game like a game? Won't ever or will ever get a high popularity. Mostly subs is like a compliment to the streamer would see it, and Twitch Turbo doesn't provide the same. It does, though. Well, okay, not the exact compliment. You can use that for bits or donations. Like, it, a sub, you know, is, yes, nice, good income. Right? But a lot of people don't actually sub. What happens is, a small portion of people sub, a super, super small people gift a shitload of subs, and then most of the people just sit there twirling their thumbs, right? If most people are sitting there twirling your thumbs, then a good most portion of your money is actually going to come from ad revenues if you're running them properly and starting to, you know, actually use them like Twitch wants you to. I used to run no ads at all on my channel, right? Zero, I tried to have all that shit off. It doesn't matter because you still get ter ads turned on in the form of pre-roll. If everybody gets hit with a pre-roll, nobody's going to want to sit through five ads to see your shit. Unless you actually, actually have a crazy, solid community and personality that you've built the stream around. And people are willing to sit through that. If you're trying to get discovered, then you have to turn on ads and you have to fucking, you know, play the game. Twitch Turbo also, it's best watching a lot of different streamers, primarily because no pre- exactly, no pre-rolls. Yep. Sub ratio is less than 30% long time, so most of them are gifted. Exactly, most of them are di gifted, so running ads is the only way to generate monthly income. Turbo thing has to work better connecting with Twitch, so the owner of the Turbo is able to show. I have a Turbo, my favorite streamer is it, Psychology. If there was, let's say, that they, you know, okay, so I could see that being a thing. To where, uh, if they increase, not the, okay, maybe, okay, if you really want to go all in on Turbo and make it to where you're subbing, like, a Netflix-type value just to Twitch and not a streamer, right? Then that has to be really worth it, and I think that they can make it worth it by, let's say, let's, uh, bump up, what, what is Turbo now? 12 bucks a month? Okay, bump it up to fourteen ninety nine. Right, so $15 a month for Turbo, and then let you pick a streamer that like $4.99, $5.99 goes to, right? And then you're paying like Twitch $9 a month, and then a streamer is getting a notification that they're getting, you know, the same $5 type sub, you know, thing between the viewer and the streamer type connection. But it's wrapped up in a monthly payment through Twitch, and then you can roll that around just like you can... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, Twitch Prime from Amazon. Since they really want to get rid of Prime and not have it be a free thing included with Amazon Prime, which is already like $80. If they just make it part of Twitch, then they're literally just doing the exact same thing, but just slightly different. I could see that actually working in their favor nicely. Turbo should include a Prime- Ex See? What did I just fucking finish saying? What did I literally just fucking finish saying? Exactly, Just Tobs. That's how you make Twitch ads, Twitch Turbo, Twitch ads less, you know, shitty. You give incentive to people to buy Turbo. Turbo lets them skip ads with their any streamer they watch. They can give their favorite streamer a, a, a Turbo sub, 
Not even call it a prime, but yeah, a, a turbo sub. It's even cooler because it's turbo. Yeah, all of that. All of that. Fixing ads on Twitch. I think we did it, boys. Success. Success. Good job. Alright, we're just passing underneath this really, really big rock here. Something here for you. Cerveza Cristal! 